to eat a little meal before I go study some more. I have my Netflix set up ready to watch, my little gongcha, some free fries, and my meal in the microwave. Ah, it's so hot. It's the continuation of my leftovers from yesterday in rice. Just gonna add a little bit of sesame oil. Oh, just spilled it, oopsies. Okay, I accidentally took too long of a break because I got caught up in watching Physical 100, but I have a lot of studying to do for midterm this week. I have a quiz that's with 10% due tomorrow, a midterm on Thursday for finance, and a midterm for organizational behavior on Friday. And then on Sunday, I have an assignment due that's worth 40% of my grade. <sighs> but thank God, the one that was 40%, the original due date was Friday, but they just emailed us today and was like, We're extending it to Sunday. So, yay. I have a lot of work to do. I am going to take off my contacts and put on my glasses because my contacts are really drying my eyes out and start studying. I just finished off my notes for organizational behavior. Look how nicely these are organized. Okay, I'm gonna go study a Oh my gosh, my makeup. I'm gonna go study a little bit more and then I'm gonna go to sleep. I'll see you tomorrow. procrastinated until it's 452 and I got back at like one ish the only thing that I need to study for today is finance 
because that's my next um, upcoming midterm. I'm really, really scared though because I am not a finance and accounting girl. I wanna be on the creative side of the industry. So this is really not my strong suit. That's why I need to put in like 223% brain power into figuring out the questions. Wish me luck. <laughs> I'm so stressed. Today, I have my finance midterm. It's worth 30% of my grade. What do I know? What do I know? Nothing. I'm just going to go into it knowing I tried my best because I studied the whole day yesterday for it and like previous days as well. But there are some questions where I just, like I don't understand. Like no matter how much time I studied, I, I still wouldn't understand it. And after my two hour finance midterm today, I can't even like take a break because I have another midterm tomorrow that's worth 26.5% of my grade. <laughs> but that one's for organizational behavior. So thank God it's not as painful to study for it. And after that, I can't even rest because I have two more assignments due on Sunday. We love midterm season. So joyous, quite literally, my fail this. Done the finance midterm. Wasn't as bad as I thought. So our prof gave us a practice midterm before the actual midterm. And there was this one question on it that I couldn't figure out. And they didn't give a work solution. They There was a button to click work solution and I pressed it and it literally just said, the answer is this and gave no explanation. So I was like, whatever, I don't know how to figure it out and it's too late for me to ask anyone. So I'm just gonna leave it and hope it doesn't come on the exam. And guess what? It was on the exam, the exact same question. So I just had to do half the question and leave the other half blank, but it's fine. It is what it is, it's over now and it's time to study for the next midterm, which is tomorrow. I think for this midterm, my strategy is to make flashcards because organizational behavior is very term heavy. and I'm gonna start studying now. So I have all the notes in a doc, which is fine. I just needed to get the information inside my head. Procedure. 
send this message when you was including me what they're sharing and why. Those are like things I get lots of when I get to be seated. And including you what. Okay, last midterm of the week. Let's go. my last midterm Yay! but I'm still not done with midterm week right now it's 12 25 and I'm getting ready to go to a cafe to work I already did my makeup the lighting here is doing it so dirty it looks like my blush is like unevenly placed but I went for a more fresh look today I really did like blush here blush here as opposed to usually I go for like a darker look and today I really want to go for a preppy vibe because I want to you know get myself in that school mode so I can do my work efficiently. So I want to wear these loafers. Do you guys see this rip right here? It's so big. And I'm wondering if I should wear leg warmers to cover it up. Let's try. Like I feel like rips and tights is okay. Like I have a pair of tights that are intentionally ripped but this one doesn't look intentional and it looks like it was by accident. So that's why I'm not really vibing with it. Okay, now for the top, I want something comfortable, but still preppy. I think I'm gonna go with this because it has gray on it as well. This was actually my dad's. I stole it from him. Do we love it? I need to accessorize. Scarf. It looks so windy outside right now. I came back because the Wi-Fi there was so bad. I had no time to spare waiting for the Wi-Fi to reconnect. 